what makes the coastal bend so unique? Well, for starters, we live right here on the water. So of course, we're gonna be eating some delicious food today, but in order to get that delicious food, we're gonna go catch it first. It's the Chris Six News Edition, Catch and Cook. We start our adventure at Marker 37, right off the JFK Causeway. This is the place to start if you're looking to take a few hours on the water catching fish and wanna bring it back for lunch. Our guide is Corpus Christi's own Joey Farah, one of the most knowledgeable guides about coastal bend fishing. Today, we're heading out on Laguna Madre. The Laguna Madre and Baffin Bay complex is what they call a hypersaline environment, which is about five times saltier than the Gulf of Mexico. That keeps the number of big game species down. So species like redfish and speckled trout are able to flourish. This morning, we'll be using live croaker as our bait. We throw these out with very little to no weight in those shallow sand pockets. And these are a natural food source and predator of the speckled trout. Not even a mile from land, we're trying to catch a hungry speckled trout for lunch. And so you can look for like two to four foot of water with grass, with scattered sand pockets and the fish hunt those scattered sand pockets. They're looking for small bait fish that stay in cover to dart out and they take advantage of them. And first cast, there's nothing like hearing the reel go off. But if you thought this was our only meal we're bringing in, that's a fish on steroids right there. You thought wrong. We caught a few gaff top sail catfish and decided why not keep one? It's also one of the most commonly caught fish in the coastal bend yes. from the bank. When you go downtown along Ocean Drive, you can catch gaff top almost every cast during the summertime. After scouring a few pockets throughout Laguna Madre, we got hungry and decided to head back in for lunch. Here at Market 37, for 60 cents a pound, you can get your fish cleaned and trimmed up from the Filet Master Chris. Then walk over to Fishtails, the newest food truck in Marker 37 with five-star culinary chef, Jeff Rosenhoover. Hey, hey. Hello, welcome. Who has worked across the country creating some of the best meals around. He can take your catch and make it into the most exquisite cuisine you've ever had. So with the gaff top, what we're gonna do, this is a seafood seasoning that, I, that we make here. Lemon, pepper, cumin, paprika, salt, pepper, chili powder. This is, I, I use this for um, my fish tacos and my shrimp tacos. And for that speckled trout. We're just going to do a little salt and pepper on that. And we're going to sear these and finish them in the oven. At Fishtails, you can expect to eat some of the freshest food all made in-house. Chef Jeff using his cilantro pesto from scratch to top off that seared trout. Cilantro lemon, lime juice, salt and pepper, garlic, and just a touch of vinegar. Once they're seared up with some color, they get put in the oven for six minutes, where Jeff then makes a citrus vinaigrette. So we have shallot, honey, Dijon, orange juice, apple cider vinegar, looking like a good vinaigrette. While the fish finishes in the oven, Jeff creates a fresh salsa, a guacamole and crab mix, and creates a garnish on top. First up, that mysterious gaff top. Slap it all together, don't forget the cheese, and oh my goodness, gaff top doesn't look so slimy anymore. Now for that trout, Jeff creates a light salad from spinach, orange slices, pickled onions that were made that morning, and some peppers. And add in that citrus vinaigrette, bring on that speck, and voila, a five-star meal within minutes from being caught. Wow, oh my gosh. Look at that. You can't get this kind of food on the water in Corpus Christi. This is five-star dockside dining. You ready? Dig in. And grapefruit, is that what that is? What is the fruit? Whoa. Gap top is so good. So it's a fish that most people catch on almost every trip around Corpus Christi Bay, but they don't realize how good of a table fare fish that is. Speckled trout, of course, go for it. Yeah, It's probably the most popular food fish in the coastal bend and is well known for its light, flaky texture. Now, neither of us had ever had gaff top before. I was always weary of it, but I must say, it was surprisingly delicious. You know, I thought it would taste a lot like just freshwater catfish, 
but the texture is a lot firmer mm -hmm. than a regular freshwater catfish. The texture is is more like an offshore fish, yeah. like a deep more water clean, fish. Meteor. Yes. We started eating at 12.01, we left at 9 o'clock. Yeah, literally within a matter of hours. Pretty good morning. That is so cool. <laughs> that is so cool. So whether you bring the whole family out, spend the day offshore, or get out on the water just for a few hours, here in the Coastal Bend you can catch and cook your fish all in one day. Now that's unique to only the Coastal Bend.